Hello shooters, old Sawtooth Carruthers with Four Peaks Armory, coming with a little show and tell today. I'm not necessarily going to do a review because it's a Glock 19, that if you don't know about them yet, um, you probably do four seconds of research online and know they have a pretty good history. However, this one is a little bit different than your normal Glock 19. As you can probably tell already, it is a gray frame um, and it's got different sights on it. Now, some of the more subtle features are also that it has an extended uh, magazine release, an extended slide stop, and it's got these pretty cool Vickers Tactical uh, magazine plates. So we're gonna get into it a little bit more, but that's the intro for you. Alright guys, so like I said, um, it's just a Glock 19, so I'm not going to beat you over the head with the details, um, but I will let you know kind of what inspired this. So um, essentially, a gun company called Lipsy's, um, Larry Vickers, who is a very prominent instructor online, and uh, Wilson Combat, and Tango Down, and essentially everybody good got together to uh, kind of take the Glock to the next level. Okay, so I know a lot of you guys like to change things on your Glock, you do the stippling and stuff like that, you put new sights on it, but if you want one that's just all ready to go, uh, this is a good option and the price point is not very bad at all. So I'll go over a few of the details on it, um, and then we might just do a little bit of shooting. So like we said, it's the limited edition gray frame, you can see that, pretty cool, although I think it might actually be a little bit more blue than gray. Perhaps uh, my eyes aren't as good as they used to be, okay? So, a few other features. It is a Gen 3, so it's not a Gen 4. Um, it has the RTF grip, which is serious. Like, if you have a good grip on this, that gun's going nowhere. Um, so you don't have to do the stipple job or any of that stuff on your own. Um, I have the grip adapter just because I have huge mitts and I get Glock bite. Um, another cool thing that they added is this little grip plug that also has a takedown tool. So uh, if you know what you're doing, you can break a Glock down to the springs with just something like this or a ballpoint pen. It's up to you, okay? So a lot of you are gonna ask a question about that. Well, how do you clear malfunctions if you've got that grip plugged up? I'll get to that, okay? Um, other cool features. Tango down, extended uh, magazine release, and sorry, I gotta flip the gun around all weird because I gotta keep pointed down range here. Um, so, Extended magazine release, um, tango down, extended slide catch, slide stop, whatever you want to call it, okay? Um, but in my mind, the biggest plus that they put on this gun is the Vickers sights, or the, I'm sorry, the Wilson Combat sights. So, first of all, they're all steel, which is already a, a step up from the Glock sights, which are, in my opinion, really bad especially if you're fixing malfunctions or anything like that. So you can see these ones have a, a hook on them to catch on your belt or your gear or whatever if you need to fix malfunctions. They also have two screws in the top and I'm hoping my camera's focusing on them. So that thing's not going anywhere. Very robust. Um, it's pretty much just a blackout rear with a fiber optic green front. And I'll tell you guys, the first shots with this, very accurate. These sights are the best upgrade. Even if you have an old Glock and you just want to shoot it better, um, I am guaranteeing if you throw these sights on an old Glock, it's going um, it's gonna to jump up. It's going to start doing stuff that it hasn't done before. So, for the most part, I think that's it. Let's shoot this damn thing. All right, guys. So, again, at its core, it's a Glock 19 Gen 3. That's pretty battle tested. So, again, I'm not going to get into the crazy details of it. Uh, I forgot to mention these vigorous tactical tango down um, magazine floor plates. And they have these little grasping sections on them so you can rip, rip it out if you've got a, uh, a malfunction. Because, as you notice, we have plugged up the hole in the Glocks that you normally use to strip malfunctions with this plug. So, last little bit of info. Let's shoot this thing a little bit, huh?
great. As you guys can see, it does its job. Um, if you're interested in this gun and guns like it, please visit us at Four Peaks Armory on gunbroker.com. Got a guy down there that can find you pretty much anything. So, again, this is Old Sawtooth Carruthers. Get a grip.